Hello, my name is Barbara Robinson, and welcome to the Knotted and Illusion Cord video. In today's video, we're going to make a couple pieces. The first piece we're going to do is similar to what they call the Tin Cup Necklace that was made famous by the movie The Tin Cup, and it's a beautiful pearl necklace that Rene Russo is wearing in the movie. You're going to learn to knot with clamshells and put the perfect spacing in, and I'm going to show you one of my little tips and tricks to get that just right every time. Then I'm going to show you how to finish a piece with French wire, which is kind of the professional way they do it, like at the fine jewelry stores. The third piece we're going to do is the illusion necklace, and we're going to use a special glue, and we're going to finish that off. Get this other pearl to come on down here and it's going to come down and just be in the spot of glue, just like so. Here are some samples to give you some inspiration. We have the Illusion pearl necklace that we created in the video, and then I went ahead and did one in little amethyst. This Illusion necklace here was a multi-strand, and to finish this one, I tied all three strands in a knot up inside the clamshell. And then I varied where I was gluing up and down so it's a more random effect and gives you a fuller, lusher necklace. This is the pearl bracelet where we knotted between every bead in the video and the tin cup necklace. And then in this tin cup necklace, I went ahead and used the tiny beads on the ends, little three millimeter Swarovski crystals and some freshwater pearls and used my spacing. On this one, these are carved labradorite um, oblong pieces, beads that I used, and it has a little sterling silver beads on either side. And then this is what they call a cathedral bead. It's kind of a reproduction of an old bead, just to show you that you can use just a glass bead also, and finished it in nice autumn colors. 